Ico Pro like anybody else. They make amazing cameras in such tiny four factors and also they're pretty cheap. So yeah, so I got the brand new GoPro Hero 11, so immediately I noticed a couple of issues with it. First of all, this issue oh. everybody has been hearing around the world, it is the overheating issues of the GoPro. So basically, if you put your GoPro uh, recording for like a while, it will eventually overheat. Yeah, and yeah, um, it's a big complaint. I, I knew that when I was buying this camera also, but um, upon using it and upon like testing it and stuff, it is really bad because it's not the point, it's not like... Oh, it's getting kind of hot. It is literally too hot to even touch. That's how hot it's getting. So, yeah. Especially in the bottom, this place right here, where I think the processor is um, inside the camera. The processor is um, down here. So, if you, like, pre touch, like, right here, it's going to it's gonna feel like you're going to burn your hands. Uh, next issue is, I don't think anybody has talked about this much, but um, GoPro webcam. So yeah, I use uh, uh, this uh, GoPro has a new feature where you can use it as a webcam. So basically, you connect it to, uh, to a computer over USB, and um, yeah, you can like start receiving a video footage. So you can use it for like conference calls, or maybe you can like uh, plug it into your camera for a streaming setup. Uh, plug into your computer, but um. There is an issue with that. Uh, it's not uh, prominent, but um, yeah, I use a Mac for my basic setup. I also have a PC down here, uh, so my Mac, everything has been working correctly. So I decided, why not try it on Windows? I tried it on Windows, and immediately gives me an error saying that it's an MTP mode, and I have to switch it over to GoPro webcam. Which is easy enough to do because the GoPro has a manual thing that on their website. Only the problem is that this is the GoPro Hero 11, and the that manual is go for the GoPro Hero 9, which means the setting is not available on here. And I tried this, looking for a lot of fixes. There is no fix for this, I think, at least to my knowledge. Maybe I'll look around a little bit more. But um, yeah, it's kind of annoying that most Windows users can't even use this because the computer just where I write tells them to change the setting which isn't a setting in the first place and yes yeah, so the two issues that I've had currently and um, yeah thank you for watching see you guys in the next video goodbye